a cold winter morning in central Michigan. Rebecca is in with Domino. You okay? A newborn kid that's had a rough first few weeks. He started favoring his leg, holding it up, not walking around. I feel bad that he's in pain, so I'm hoping that will get resolved. Don, come on in with the kids right, and the kid and the kid. <laughs> he peed right there. Oh my gosh! Well, at least that's working. No. Come on in. So what's the problem? He's got a lump where? He is, is... favoring his back right leg. <laughs> You're OK. This is all swollen up right here. Yeah. When I examined it, it's just one leg, and there's pus in there in the joint. Now, feel that? There's a little bit of what you call a pipe navel. OK. And when I check the navel, the navel is hard. Bacteria crawl through here, go through the blood, and end up in the joint because the joint is like a filter, very, very small. This, <laughs> then this is joint ill. OK, that's this what is I was wondering. <laughs> Sorry, I, I did research. <laughs> Good. This is a bacterial infection that comes through the belly button because they were born where it was dirty and some bacteria get in the bloodstream. Blood vessels in the joints are so small that the bacteria get caught in there and then you get a joint infection also. <laughs> <laughs> Most of the time, a very heavy antibiotic cure for about seven to 10 days will take care of it. Just like this. Penicillin. Underneath the skin. Not in the muscle or anything like this, because if you put it in the muscle so many days, you'll kill them because you ruin the muscle. OK. Oh. Don't give it to the kids. OK. <laughs> <laughs> Pipe navel and a joint. This is Dr. Nicole. She's always interested in these things, and I usually grab them. OK, I feel what? The pipe, the pipe navel. The umbilical cord. Umbilical cord, that's the pipe navel. Okay. That should be yeah. nothing. And then feel and then... this joint. Don't pinch it, because she'll scream at you. It's joint ill. I'm sorry. I told you that. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Nicole has good experience, but she wants a lot more. So she just comes over and has a feel of the leg so that she knows what's going on. No, you can't have them. <laughs> she already has a bond. She's looking for animals. <laughs> oh. Most of these animals come out of it real good. But it takes some time, and you can't give up too soon. All right. Take care, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm really glad we came. Dr. Pohl knew exactly what was wrong with him. He's so good with my kids. I'm really amazed. He seems to know a little bit about everything or a lot about everything. <laughs>